and sometimes you can Jupiter with different Jupiters. The Jupiter, Jupitering, when you ask, what is a Jupiter notebook? And then you can say, no, look, time, oh, woo, wee. That's amazing. And then you can do some running queries, running queries. Look, there's running queries, queries running two and a half decades. Oh no, had a problem. Yay, look, some things. Wow, look, press the buttons. Oh no, click. Oh, it's terrible, ah. Oh look, now we've got a thing and a thing and there's that thing. Oh dear, we've got a thing. Let's do that thing. Oh no, we don't want it like that. We want it like this. We'll just swap that over there. Now we minimise that. That goes over there. Put that over there. Do some of that. Now we can do this. So we can do that and then we can click to there and oh look, ready, woo, and it's going to be gone, gone. Oh, this is your stuff. Ready, two, that's number two. Then you have, there's your results. Oh, and ah, they've all gone. They're gone. Where have they gone? They're all gone. But I'm a DBA, woohoo, now I can stop. Hiya. Hi. Welcome to SQL Bits in London, or, or not in London. I'm not in London. Um, hello. Welcome to SQL Bits that's not in London, e even though it's in London. This is our new norm, and it's, it's a bit weird. I thought I'd wear my volunteer shirt because... When I'm at SQL Bits, I love to be in the orange shirt helping people. As I said, I'm not in London. Take 4,321. Hi. Welcome to SQL Bits. You're here to have a thing that doesn't fucking work, you fucking bastard shit bug. to ask me questions. I'd love to answer any questions that you have. I thought I'd wear my orange shirt though, because this is how I love to be in SQL bits. And SQL Bits virtual event, take 4,972. Hi, my name's Rob Sewell, and welcome to SQL Bits virtually. Well, literally welcome to SQL Bits, but to the virtual SQL Bits. So a wise man told me that we should always do demonstrations in light mode. So I'm going to use light mode for this demonstration. Let's press enter. I'm also going to turn on screencast mode, which means that then we can get that. Demo time. So I'm going to start with this page. Why, why have you started with this page, Rob? Well, as you can see, the number one most requested feature for Management Studio is dark theme. Now, if we look at, oh, if we look at this, it's got the wrong theme on it, hasn't it? So let's start with dark theme. And we can the number one choice of fucking hell, fire, last and damn it. See, he's processed all of these jobs. 
And that should mean that source control will now pick up. And totally not pick up what I want it to. And at the moment, it looks like source control isn't picking me up. I press git status, nothing to come in. Excellent. Hello and welcome to a presentation. This is a presentation. I'm going to do a presentation. So we're going to have some stuff like that. We're probably going to have that one down like this. Then we're going to do some of that. Then some of this. Then when we end, we can go to that, which doesn't look too bad. Then we could just run this. Hopefully that's going to do some stuff, which it is. It's going to bring that up which is fucking shit, it's not working. SQL Bits 2020 Virtual Event. Rob Sewell, Jupyter Notebooks, take 5,326,000. Hiya, my name's Rob. Welcome to SQL Bits 2020, virtually. Well, actually welcome, but virtually SQL Bits. This is obviously the new way that we do live events. Of enabling a notebook to be run by anybody and provide them with great results. Now I'm going to have my tea. Do you take so long to run? Take so long to run. No six. I think some things are timing out. Maybe I turned them. Perhaps I will just stop this. An instance and a job. You can see all it is, is the T-SQL job. And you can see we're getting our changes, what our last commit was. And whilst this was running, normally took about a minute, but today seems to take a little bit longer. So I'm just going to pause for a second. And that for me is the number one biggest reason why kittens shouldn't be allowed in the office when you're doing a recording. But also, why DBAs should use Jupyter Notebooks. So what's the Jupyter Notebook? Well, it's easy. It's a document that contains text, executable code, images, and the query results. I like to use Azure Data Studio to make sure that the kitten out and you Thanks very much. <clears throat> so
So what's Azure Data Studio? 